Well, I can tell you a tale. I was in Los Angeles. I was walking down Sunset Boulevard, and I, you know, I was telling you guys I have bad allergies. I generally am not a fan of the City of Angels. And so I was walking down the street, and I was just dying of thirst and, like, sick and sneezing and just gross. My throat was closing up. I was like, God, I just need an orange juice. All I want is, like, an orange juice. That's all I want. We got to drive back, like, nine hours. All I want before we drive back is just a single can of OJ. We had walked past at least five or six juice places, so I was like, okay, we're in the right place. This is like health food, crazy town, everyone in L.A. D doing their runs and getting their matcha juice. Like, there's going to be somebody that's got a stupid orange juice. So we go into one place, you know, it's like Nature Well or something, and there's like a line of 20 people, and I'm looking at the, the juices, and it's just like smoothies, and just none of it's like actual juice. And so we leave. And I look across the street, and there's a place called... This is literally the name of the place. Juice is served here. That was the name of the institution. Okay, so I was like, all right, all right, you know. There are a lot of bullshit places, clearly, on Sunset Boulevard. But juice is served here. I think we're going to find just straight orange juice. This is just, it's going to happen. So it took us like an hour to cross the street because the pedestrians have no right of way in Los Angeles. You know, only $100,000 Lamborghinis can get anywhere. And so we, we finally get across the street. We go into this place. Juice is served here. It's a room that's probably twice the size of my apartment with a single counter. And there's one kind of just zombified L.A. Uh, person staring at his phone behind the counter and I look behind the counter and expecting some kind of menu anything that would imply like that this is an actual functional business and uh, there's just nothing it's just a concrete wall and a counter and then I look to the left and there's a small refrigerator like waist high and I look in the fridge and there are maybe like 12 plastic bottles of juice and I'm like okay okay some of them look orange Let's see what's going on here. And I walk up to the guy and I'm like, hi, how you doing? And he's like, hey, the juice is right there. And I'm like, yeah, I, I see you've got these 12 bottles of juice. That's great. And so I'm looking and there's like a lemonade. And then I read the fine print and it's like lemonade with like jalapeno and like wheatgrass and just bullshit. And I'm like, okay, maybe, maybe the orange, there's an orange one here. Okay, what's in the orange? It's like a mango, you know, clementine, blah, blah, blah. With But then like, you know, it's got like, sort of orangey things in it, but not actual orange juice. And then on top of that, like more grass or just bitter ingredients and, and just injected vitamins and just all this stuff. And it's like six ingredients. And I'm like, all right. I talk to the guy, I'm like, so do you, do you guys just like juice juice here? Like you just, he's like, no, it's just the cans. And I'm, I'm like, okay, okay. So like, do, do you have orange juice like in the back or something? He's like, no, nah, man, you're going to have to go to nature well. And I just... <laughs> I, <laughs> rather than cross the street again for 20 minutes, I gave up and left Los Angeles with no orange juice. There were like six orange juice, or juice places rather. None of them looked like they had a just straight up orange juice. I wanted to die. I left there faster than I've ever left the city. It was not great. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say about LA. It's, it's the worst.